Here I am at the Polcam stand here at IBC 2013. Of course, Polcam, well known for their jibs, mini cams, and accessories. We spoke about the uh, the Polcam jibs before, but let's concentrate on the mini cams and accessories, which you've got a great display of here. Uh, we're going to go for a little walk down the stand. So let's talk about what we got here. Well, what we're trying to do is, you know, we're trying to show off the products that we've got, the cameras that we use, but we're also trying to bring in the accessories because it's not just about a crane. You've got to power a crane, you've got to have an eye on the crane, you've got to do everything. So, you know, we talked uh, earlier on, you and I, at TerraDeck about the PAG Link battery system. You know, for us, it's a dream come true. You've got to have weight on a thing anyway. So rather than putting one or two batteries on, I put six batteries on the back. It gives me less counterweight, gives me power running all day, it gives you peace of mind. In this day and age, when you've got less and less people in a production, the cameraman has more and more to do. If he doesn't have to worry about batteries and chargers, it's fantastic. Little things like the PAG Hub that we've seen here somewhere a little USB yeah, output yeah, yeah. you know you can be on location there's nowhere to plug in we're all living on phones they're an important part of what we do so then moving on down uh, Toshiba mini cams yes. they've been a mainstay for pole cam for a long time yeah. originally endoscopy microscopy cameras yeah. brought into the um, broadcast industry and they're stunning and they're still stunning you know and, and it's quite strange lifetime of cameras seems to be moving very quickly but these are still here and producing knockout pictures yeah. then as we've talked before it's about the lenses as well yes. we've got this fantastic crane we've got these great cameras but you know I, I liken it to having a fantastic car you yeah. might have a Ferrari or a Veyron or something but you're putting Ford POS tires on yeah, yeah. you know the wheels and tires are so important yeah. baby zoom lenses yeah. the first full HD miniature tracking zoom lens and this is making great headways and believe it or not actually we're starting to sell this into industrial applications right. as well because we've actually got a customer that's now these are 600 meters underwater wow. in housings yeah. for uh, pipeline inspection and what have you they need the quality yeah. and they need the compact size yeah. moving on this is your favorite bucket and going past again <laughs> This is, this is really exciting. This is a Canadian uh, industrial military contractor. It's got a fantastic camera, been out for a few years. They want to get into the broadcast game. And you know what? They listen to what we say. Everything we say to IO about their 2K flare camera, little problems that they've never seen before because of the industrial and medical, they're correcting them instantly. Like sometimes within 24 to 48 hours, it's a real breath of fresh air to deal with people like this. For us, moving on again, here's Yoda, he's always very good. For us, moving on again, Panasonic come out with a new range of mini cams. A l tiny little three chipper here, check this out, look at that. Wow. Look at the size of that camera. This is a single chip, one third inch CMOS, tiny, and the prices are fantastic as well. And finally, moving on, this is what I'm loving. So I was uh, shooting uh, Rory McIlroy and Tiger Woods. Yep. Took me five days to prep this whole shoot with a full OB company for a four hour event. Nice. But it was, it was a one-on-one -on -one golf match. Yep. We took this high-speed mini cam. Yep. It's, now we've all seen high-speed mini cams. They've been around for a while. Phantom with the Miro. <clears throat> the beauty of this is instant live replay. Right. This on a pole cam. Yep directly overhead, the golf swing coming round, we're seeing the flex in the club, we're seeing spinal angles. Yeah. Commentators are loving this sort of thing. We've got these now on the pole cams actually in Moscow. They've just been doing track and field events and they've been doing switchback booms on things like the steeplechase. So the guys are coming over and the camera's flying really fast back the other way. They love the shots so much, every single bumper, trailer, sting that went out everywhere, it's being used, you know. So although we seem to have had this bit of a departure into the bigger heads and the larger cameras, mini cams are making a resurgence again because they're doing things now that the other bigger cameras can't do, either because of the physical size or the price. You know, that makes a huge difference. So, you know, we're still here, we're still strong, and uh, we're really excited. It's been a fantastic show. So um, thank you for dropping by. You're welcome. It's always great to see you have an amazing line of products. It's not just the, the great pole cam jibs, but as you say, the mini cams and the accessories as well. Now, if people want to find out some more information about your pole cam rigs, the mini cams, the battery solutions, is there a website they can go to? 
www.polcam.com. Stefan, thank you very much. Thank you very much indeed. Go and have a look at their website. The link is on the screen right now, and you'll find everything you need to know about the Polcam product range. Everything we're doing here at IBC 2013 is on our website, which is broadcastshow.com. We are live, transmitting across the world right now. Are you excited about this? Audience here, and hello to everybody watching on the web. Thank you so much for, for showing up for me. Welcome to the Threadneedle Parliamentarian of the Year Awards of 2011. Through the wonder of the World Wide Web, tonight's service can be seen throughout the world. Welcome to the start of a wonderful journey.